Hello and welcome to another episode of today's GK. Let's begin with the practice question of the last segment. Consider the following statements regarding Bharatnatyam. The origin of this dance can, can be traced to the Sage Bharat Muni's Nati Shastra. It is the only form of classical dance wedded to Hindustani music. Raman Kutti Nair and Kala Mandalam Gopi were the prominent artists of Bharatnatyam. So we have to select the correct statement. Only the first is correct. A is the correct answer. Remembering choreographer and Bharatnatyam dancer Rukmani Devi Arundale, who left an indelible impact on the cultural landscape of our country on her death anniversary. Bharatnatyam dance is known to be a career where one dancer takes on many roles in a single performance. The origin of this dance can be traced to the sage Bharat Muni's Nati Shastra and in its usual form. The dance is generally broken into seven main parts Ali Rippu, Jatiswaran, Shabd, Varn, Pad, Thilanna and Shloka. Bharatnatyam possess are depicted on the Gopurams of the Chidambaram Temple in Tamil Nadu. E. Krishna Ayyar and Rukmini Devi Andale had played a significant role in helping the dance regain its lost popularity and position. Kathak is the only form of da- classical dance wedded to Hindustani or North Indian music. Raman Kutti Nair and Kalamandalam Gopi were prominent artists of Kathakali. Consider the following statements. Narsin Mehta was a 15th century poet and devotee of Lord Krishna. Narsin Mehtai is a new species of spider discovered in Gujarat. So we have to select the correct statement. Both are correct. C is the correct answer here. Recently, researchers of Bhakti Dikavi, Narsin Mehta University, Junagar, discovered a new species of spider. The species was named Narsin Mehta in honor of Narsin Mehta, who was a 15th century poet and devotee of Lord Krishna. However, members of Nagar subcaste group of Brahmin community in which Mehta was born and admirers of the poet objected to the nomenclature. They argued that there was no need to associate his name with a spider. He penned more than 750 poems called Pad in Gujarat and they mainly deal with devotion to Lord Krishna, Gyan, Vairagya. Gyan means wisdom, Vairagya means detachment from worldly affairs. Others like Shan Shanu Viva, Kun Var Bainu Mameru, Hundi and Harmala are believed to be autobiographical accounts of different occasions of his life. Vaishnava Bhajan to Tene Kahiye, Mahatma Gandhi's favorite bhajan is his creation. Consider the following statements regarding Rotterdam Convention. It aims to promote shared responsibility and cooperative efforts among parties in the international trade of certain hazardous chemicals. The convention creates legally binding obligations for the implementation of the prior informed consent procedure. We have to select the correct statement. Both the statements are correct. C is the correct answer. The Supreme Court recently issued notice on a petition seeking contempt act against Kerala. This was done for not disbursing rupees 5 lakh each as compensation to the victims of endosulfan pesticide exposure, which is an organic chlorine insecticide which was first introduced in the 1950s and is commonly known by its trade name Theodan. Endosulfan is listed under the Rotterdam Convention and the Stockholm Convention on Persistent Organic Pollutants. The text of the Rotterdam Convention was adopted on 10 September 1998 by the Conference of Plino Potentiaries in Rotterdam, the Netherlands. The convention entered into force on 24th February 2004, which aims to promote shared responsibility and cooperative efforts among parties in the international trade of certain hazardous chemicals. The convention creates legally binding obligations for the implementation of prior informed consent procedures. Methi people recently seen in the news are native to which of the following states? The correct answer is option A, Manipur. A demand for granting scheduled tribe status to Maitis has found no takers among the political parties in poll-bound Manipur. These people are ethnic group having native to the having been native to the state of Manipur in northeastern India. They are dominant community in 40 of the 60 assembly seats in straddling, straddling the Imphal and Jiribam valleys. A majority follow Hinduism, while more than 8% are Muslim, locally known as Pangals. A pro-ST status movement ahead of the two-phase election was expected to have been a poll issue, but it found no place in the manifestos of either the national or regional parties. Consider the following statements. More than a quarter of the world's wheat exports come from Russia and Ukraine. Egypt is the top country by wheat imports in the world. Success of Green Revolution contributed to the growth of Kharif crops, especially wheat. We have to select the correct statement. Only the first statement is correct and also the second is correct. So the correct answer should be 1 and 2. A. Russian-Ukraine crisis might give India an opportunity to export more wheat in the global markets. 
India's central pool stood at 24.2 million tons, twice more than the buffer and strategic needs. More than a quarter of the world's wheat export comes from Russia and Ukraine, and India is the second largest producer after China. Top wheat producing states in India are Uttar Pradesh, Punjab, Madhya Pradesh, Haryana, and Rajasthan. This is the second most important cereal crop and the main food crop in North and Northwestern India, and success of the Green Revolution contributed to the growth of Rabi crops, especially wheat. Egypt is the top country by wheat imports in the world. Moving on, we have to meet, match the streets with the joining seas or water bodies. Formosa Strait, Java Sea and Indian Ocean, Bosphorus Strait, the Black Sea to Sea of Marmara, Hudson Strait, Hudson Bay and Labrador Sea. So, we have to see which ones are correctly matched. Only the second and third are B is the correct answer. Ukraine has asked Turkey to close the Bosphorus and Dardanelles Strait to Russia's Russian ships after Russia launched air and ground assaults on its neighbor, that is Ukraine. Formosa Strait is between China and Taiwan, which connects the South China and the East China Sea. Bosphorus Strait is a natural strait, connecting the Black Sea to the Sea of Marmara and Hudson Strait links the Atlantic Ocean and Labrador to Hudson Bay in Canada. Remember that. Consider the following statements with respect to Baltic countries. These are the southeastern region of uh, Europe, containing these countries of Estonia, Latvia and Lithuania. Russians are the largest minority in Lithuania, so we have to select the correct statement. Both are incorrect. D is the correct answer. The three Baltic states have called for NATO to reinforce its presence on their territories. Baltic states, northeastern region of Europe containing the countries of Estonia, Latvia and Lithuania on the eastern shores of the Baltic, northeastern region, not southeastern. The Baltic states are bound on the west and north by the Baltic Sea, on the east by Russia, southeast by Belarus, southwest by Poland and an exclave of Russia. At the beginning of the 21st century, the titular nationalities of Lithuania and Estonia counted for about four-fifth and two-third of the country's population, respectively. Around this time, Poles eclipsed Russians as the largest minority in Lithuania. With respect to cooperative societies in India, consider the following statements. Indian cooperatives are governed by the Central Act for national cooperatives and cooperatives which operate in more than one state. In 1990, cooperation became a provincial subject and provinces were authorized to make their own cooperative laws under the montago Shemsford reform. So we have to select the correct statement. Both are correct. C is the correct answer here. The government is in the process of drafting new cooperative policy. Indian cooperatives were governed, are governed by the Central Act for National Cooperatives and Cooperatives which operate in more than one state. In case of cooperatives which have an area, the area of operation within the state, they are governed by Cooperative Societies Act of the respective states. In India, a cooperative society can be formed under the provision of Cooperative Societies Act of 1912. The provision states that at least 10 people above the age of 18 years having the capacity to enter into a contract with common economic objectives can form a cooperative society. British India first enacted the Cooperative Credit Society Act of 1904. And in 1990, cooperation became a provincial subject and provinces were authorized to make their own cooperative laws under the montago Shemsford reform. With respect to exercise banan, consider the following statements. It is an annual multilateral exercise. The theme of this year's exercise is Kamaradari. Cohesion Collaboration. Milan began with the participation of only four countries, namely Indonesia, Singapore, Sri Lanka and Thailand. So we have to select the correct statement. Only the second and third are correct. B is the correct answer. The Navy's Milan 2022 will begin in Vishakhapatnam today and it is the largest ever edition of the exercise that will see the participation of 40 countries. The biennial exercise is being conducted after four years and the theme of the year is Kamara Dairy. Cohesion collaboration. It aims to project India as a responsible maritime power to the world at large. And a multilateral exercise that began in 1995 with the participation of four countries, Indonesia, Singapore, Sri Lanka and Thailand. Earlier, it was conducted only at Anman and Nicobar Command, but because of the large number of participants, it has been shifted to Eastern Naval Command. Devayatanam an odyssey of Indian temple architecture is being organized in which of the following states? The correct answer is A. Karnataka. The Archaeological Survey of India of the Ministry of Culture is organizing a two-day international conference, Devayatanam, an odyssey of Indian temple architecture at Karnataka's Hampi, Karnataka. Consider the following statements with respect to Archaeological Survey of India. It was established in the year 1861, the underwater wing of the Archaeological Survey of India was established in 2001. So we have to select the correct statement or statements. Both the statements are correct. C is the correct answer. The underwater wing of ASI is being revived for exploration in four states with a significant coastline. Officials in the Ministry of Culture have said that. 
It was established in the year 2001. The Underwater Archaeological Service Wing has to its credit the exploration of Elephant Islands, Mahabalipuram and the Bay of Bengal. Aside in Puducherry, the excavation of a shipwreck named Princess Royal in Lakshadweep. ASI is under the Ministry of Culture, which was established in the year 1861. It is the premier institution in India concentrating on archaeological researches, explorations, excavations and protection and preservation of monuments and sites of national importance. So, let's move on to the practice question for the next segment. Consider the following statements. The Battle of Sarai Ghat was fought on the banks of Brahmaputra. It is one of the greatest naval battles of, on a river which resulted in the victory of our homes over British. So, that's it for today. Tomorrow, we shall meet again with another segment. Until then, stay updated. And thank you so much for watching.